Hey, what is going on, YouTube? I know I haven't uploaded in a while, but I do think that this will make up for it. But anyways, looking at the teams, I have Zabstraka Salamence. Smeargle, you will not see Salamence. Looking at their team, they've got the Ferrothorn, they've got the Firewater Grass. Let's just go with that. But yeah, so let's just jump right into this. But anyways, so I'm facing, of course, a dra Japanese trainer, as I usually do. And I lead off with Zebstrika. Now this is Spexed, uh, Timid, so it does pack a punch, and it is pretty quick with its naturally high speed. So first turn, this turns out to be a Scarf Darmanitan, which outspeeds me. And first turn, sadly, gets a crit. That kind of annoyed me, but in the long run, it doesn't really matter. Because um, he does switch out, and he goes into his... Uh, I think he goes in... Yes, he does go into his Lantern, so... He goes into his lantern, and this is the perfect opportunity to go into Smeargle. Now I go for the Spore. Now you're all probably thinking, oh, he's just going to go for, you know, Shell Smash. Baton passed that over to Salamence. Why would I do that when I have Smeargle? He can learn any move in the game. You know, this thing is just going to belly drum. I don't have Baton Pass on this thing. That's boring. No one likes Baton Passing. You know, that's the same thing over and over. Baton Pass a bunch and just hit everything with one Pokemon. No, I actually want to take Smeargle, and I want to make him do some damage for a change. Give him the spotlight now. So, I go for the extreme speed, uh, hoping to hit the Lantern, but he does switch into his Ferrothorn to take it. And even after resisting, that does about a fourth. And then he takes Iron Barb's damage, uh, Smeargle does, and now he's going to go into his Lantern. Not really sure what he's thinking, but uh, I do have Technician, so this flame, will, flame Wheel will be boosted to 90 base power rather than 60. And once again, even after being resisted, that does about 40%. So now I am safe to go for the extreme speed. And after plus 6 with that Belly Drum, that will easily take out the Lantern. So this is just basically the rest of the match, watching Smeargle smash everything. So Ferrothorn comes in here thinking, alright, he's going to go for another Flame Wheel, which I do, but I really don't mind, because even if he does go into this, I know I can go for the Extreme Speed. So once again, hit him with a 90 base power Flame Wheel because of Technician, and it nearly does 50%, so now I can just safely go for the Extreme Speed, which will easily take it out, so all that's left is Ferrothorn. Now, of course, I'll put a calc on the screen so you guys can see how much this does. But anyways, plus 6, 90 base power flame wheel, 4 times super effective, just massacre. That's just a massacre for Ferrothorn. That just demolished 3 Ferrothorns. I don't know exactly, but that was just overkill. But yeah, so sorry for having, having been uploading in a little while. But anyways, that is the match. Smeargle actually does sweep an entire team on his own. He is not going to baton pass to anything anymore. But yeah, so thank you guys for watching. That is a Smeargle sweep. Hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, thank you for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.